unit digit questions. How to solve unit digit questions in exams? So this is the steps which you, have, you can follow for all the questions to get the answer. First, take the power and divide it by 4. Next, if the reminder is 0, take it as 4. If it is 1, take it as 1. If it is 2, take it as 2. If it is 3, take it as 3. So just take the power and divide it by 4. If you divide it by 4, it's 26 times 104. And the reminder is 1. So we need only the reminder. If the reminder is 1, we have to take it as 1. What we have to find? 7 power 105. So the base is 7. Reminder we got as 1. So take it as 1. 7 power 1 is 7. So the unit digit of this number, 7 power 105, is 7. Next, see in this example, we can follow the same steps. That is, take the power and divide it by 4. Check the reminder. That's, just check the reminder. Reminder is 0 here. And here 373 divided by 4. Reminder is 1. After that, just take the unit digit of the base, which is 4. Reminder is 0 means take it as. Reminder is 0, take it as 4. Then, unit digit of this number 4. Reminder we got as 1, so take it as 1. 4 power 4 is 256 and 4 power 1 is 4. Take the unit digit is 6 plus 4, it's 10. So, the unit digit is 0. The unit digit of this summation answer is 0. We can find by the following the steps or there is alternate way. That is this table. That is if the last digit of the base is 4. Here see a 4 right. In this case we can follow this table. That is if the last digit of the number is 0. See here in this if the what is the unit digit of this means. It's 0 only because the last digit of this is 0. The last digit of this is 0 then its unit digit is going to be 0 only. Okay. And if the last digit of the number is 1, 1, then its unit digit is going to be 1. So we can simply so substitute the unit digit as 1. If the last digit of the number is 5, then to the power anything gives you the unit digit 5. Okay. So if the last digit of its 6 to the power anything, its unit digit is, will be always 6. So remember this table. Just check the last digit. If the last digit is 0, unit digit is 0. If it is 1, unit digit 1. 5, unit digit 5. 6, unit digit 6. If the last digit is 4, if the last digit is 4, just check the power. If it has even power, then its unit digit will be 6. If the last digit is 4 and if it has odd power, then its, if it has odd power, then its unit digit will be 4. Okay. So here this is for 9. If the nine, last digit is 9 and if it has odd power, then its unit digit will be 9. For example, see here 279 to the power 25. Here the last digit is 9. So, just check the power. Power is odd. If it is odd, then its unit digit will be 9. Okay. Suppose if it has even power, then its unit digit will be 1. Okay. So, you have to remember this table to solve if the last digit is 0, 1, 5, 6, 4, 9, you can use this table. See, I solved the same problem by this, okay. Just check the unit digit, last digit of the base, which is here 4. So, if it is 4, what we have to do? Just check the power. If the power is even, even, we have to substitute as unit digit as 6. Then, if the last digit of the base is 4, just check the power. Power is odd. Odd means unit digit is going to be 4. So, just add now. 10. So, unit digit is 0. We got the same answer. So, you can use this table to find the unit digit. See, if the last digit is 0, 1, 5, 6, 4, 9, you can follow this table. Or the rest, if the last digit is 2 or 3 or 7 or 8, you can follow this to find the unit digit. Here in this question, the unit digit. To find the unit digit, check the last digit of the base. If it is 7, last digit is 7, then these steps. Just take the power and divide it by 4. Reminder is here 1. Reminder is 1. If the reminder is 1, take the last digit. And if the reminder is 1, take it as 1. Next here in this, the last digit is 1. If the last digit is 1, unit digit is 1. Simply substitute. So 7 power 1 is 7 and into 1, so 7. Unit digit of this product is 7. Next here in this, the last digit is 1. So, unit digit 1. Last digit is 4. So, unit digit. 
for that we need to check the power power is even so if the even power then unit digit is 6 then here last digit is 3 if it is 3 then these steps take the power and divide it by 4 so here the remainder is 1 if the remainder is 1 so here if the remainder is 1 see the remainder is 1 so take the last digit and the remainder is what 1 if you divide it by 4 remainder is 1 so remainder is 1 means take it as 1 next last digit is 5 unit digit will be 5 so now multiply 1 into 6 6 into 3 it's 18 18 into 5 it's 90 so the unit digit of this product is 0 0 is the answer Last digit is 5. So unit digit is 5. It's simple. Here the last digit is 7. So 7 power what? For that we have to take the power and divide it by 4. If the last digit is 7, these steps take the power and divide it by 4. Reminder is 1. So take that reminder and write here. Reminder is 1 means 1. So take that and write here. So 7 power 1, answer 7. Next, unit digit is 7. Here in this the last digit is 3. So Take the power and divide it by 4. So the reminder will be 3. Now take the last digit. Reminder is 3 means 3 only. Then last digit is 1. So the unit digit is 1. Simply substitute. 3 power 3 is 27. So it's the unit digit. We have to take only the unit digit. 7 into 1, 7. Unit digit of this product is 7.